We work hard and we play hard. Yeah, we do. Uh -huh. That's what we do. And you, Hulk Hogan, you're a punk. Yeah, you are. And uh, Triple H, you already know I'm gonna bitch slap you. And take your girl, Stephanie McMahon. Get on my back, because I can take the pressure. Yes, I can. <laughs> here a rather long box but there's only gonna be one pop in it it would fit at least two but I know this is an order from eBay that is only one Funko Pop and what a Funko Pop it is a grail for me one that I've really wanted since day one and other ones have sort of taken priority but I'm really glad that I was finally able to pick this up at a fairly good price, £26 I think, and then another £3 odd in postage, so just under £30. Here is the trusty knife. I will now have a slizzle. Woo! Should I decide the best way to open this? A very light box, but like I say, very long. Perhaps this was the only one the seller had to hand. This was an eBay auction, by the way. So with this being, including postage, almost £30, it is one of the more expensive pops in my collection. But it's a vaulted one. I think it came out probably 2015. I will put the Funko app valuation up on screen shortly. Are we in yet? Yes, I believe we are. Oh, there's a spoiler as to who it is on this Jiffy envelope. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah! Ooh, yeah! Dig it! It's Macho Man Randy Savage. Now, those of you who are long-time subscribers to my channel, i.e. since probably last September, October, I did a top five WCW wrestler wish list, and I'd put NWO Randy Savage in at number five, I think it was. Obviously, I knew this one was out, and I think there's another variant of this as well, some exclusive, and I think he's got blue tights, possibly. No NWO Macho Man, and I've kind of thought, should I get this one? And certainly more recent weeks, recent months, I thought, yeah, if I can get Randy Savage, even just the standard one, for a good price, then, yeah, I'll get it. I finally have him in my collection. Massively happy. The box, it's not brilliant. See, there's the plastic's kind of starting to get holes in it there, but I'm going to be taking him out of the box anyway. A quick look at the box shows the top, the bottom, yep, the old Funko logo, the sides, it's a really nice image of the Randy Savage pop there, the front, he is number 10 in the WWE range, so fairly early on, only I think the second wave of WWE pops, and the back, we'll have a closer look at the back to see if I've got any more of these, uh, not really. Not got Daniel Bryan or The Undertaker. I've not got Triple H. I have got Randy Savage now, of course. I've got Hollywood Hogan, which I think came out around the same time as that. That is my favourite pop, early grail for me. And it's still, at the time of me recording this, is my most expensive pop, but also my favourite. And there is also AJ Lee. AJ Lee goes for an absolute fortune now. Just crazy money. As I do with all my wrestling pops, I'm going to get the Macho Man out of his box. Doesn't come with a stand. Ah, oh, awesome. Wow. Yeah, it's not the NWO version. This Randy Savage, this is kind of his mid-80s look. Kind of his around the time where he had been Intercontinental Champion and then he turned babyface and joined up with Hulk Hogan, and then he won his first WWF world title. This is his look from that era, but such a fantastic pop nonetheless. I really love the orange bandana with the white stars. 
his sunglasses where you can just see his eyes through the lenses. I've said this before, I do like Pops with glasses on. He's got long brown hair and his famous beard. He's got orange with white stars wrestling trunks on that match his bandana. He's also got white wristbands, sort of a paler orange, almost yellowy knee pads and orange boots with white laces. Fantastic pop this, so happy to have got this. I've been not looking for it loads, but just keeping my eye out every now and again and an auction was coming up and I thought, well, let's see if I can get this for under my maximum sort of price. And I did. Yes. Thank you everybody for watching this video. I do hope you enjoyed me unboxing an absolute legend and Hall of Famer, the Macho Man Randy Savage. Thank you to all my subscribers. If you're a new subscriber to the channel, welcome. It's wonderful to have you all here. Please don't forget to enter my We May 500 giveaway. We're not far off 500 subs at all. And as soon as I hit 500, I'm going to make that draw. The prize on offer, I'm sure you all know what it is by now. I've hyped this plenty of times already. It's the Captain Crunch and Crunchberry Beast vinyl two-pack. And it's a Funko Specialty Series as well. With that really attractive Specialty Series sticker on. Check it out. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Enter in the video which I've linked to in the description down below with the hashtag WeMay500 and your favourite breakfast cereal. If you would like discounts on Funko Pops from Pop in a Box, Culture Freak and Hull Pops, I've got links for those in the description and I've also got a referral link for All Things Vinyl for their amazing pop protectors and other Funko protectors. I'm going to go now and add the Macho Man to my wrestling cabinet. And I do hope you all join me again next time for another Funko Pop unboxing. Cheers, everyone. See ya!